When I was three, my parents didn't want me to drown, so they had me start taking swim lessons. Um, and I and really enjoyed it, and from there I just kept on going, and I joined um, the splash team at Aloha, and um, uh, eventually joined the Dolphins, which is my club team, and um, just kept swimming. And then when I got to high school, I joined the Aloha swim team as well. In third grade, when the Winter Olympics was happening, we wrote New Year's resolutions, and I wrote mine, I want to be a gold medal Olympian. And um, I, at that, that point, I didn't, I didn't think that it was really possible, um, but I still actually have it on my wall. Caitlin Dobler is getting closer to that goal. She's ranked fourth in the U.S. in the 100-meter breaststroke. At the end of June, I'll go to Omaha, Nebraska to compete at the Olympic Trials. And um, from their athletes who get uh, first and second in their events, they uh, go on to compete in Tokyo at the Olympics. Goes on, work the end the waters. Yep. She does her training with the Dolphins swim team in the outdoor pool at Beaverton's West Hills Racket and Fitness Club. That training led her to the Junior World Championships in Budapest, Hungary last summer. She won three medals. But it's the swimming she does as part of the Aloha High School team that really sets her apart. It's a really great team atmosphere, and it's unlike uh, any other community that I've been a part of. And so I really enjoy and appreciate everything that they've done for me, and I try to give back to them as much as possible. The swimmers and her coach at Aloha say Caitlin is an amazing teammate. Despite having all of these amazing talents, she likes to put the shine on like other people and other people really get the spotlight as well. She wants to be a team effort. She could just be sticking with the club or be anywhere else but with our team, but instead she wants to stick with us and be part of our team, be part of our family. Caitlin is signed to swim at USC next year. Her high school coach will have some lasting memories of her time at Aloha. One of the things I've probably learned the most from Caitlin Dobler is balance. I've never seen anybody so grounded and so balanced. And that's a gift she's given me. And I appreciate it more than anybody could ever know. She's still got some unfinished business in high school swimming. The mm -hmm. uh, districts are coming up in the state meet. She wants to set the national record for the 100-yard breast. Ah, uh, what a great goal. Oh, yeah. So we'll cool. Be, so June Omaha. June we'll be Omaha. rooting for her to be we'll one be or watching. two so she goes to the Olympics. <laughs> That's right. That'd be exciting yeah. to watch really her exciting. in Tokyo. Oh, yeah. yeah. That would be cool. <laughs>